friendships are sources of joy and happiness. Which is why in 2011, the International Friendship Day was set aside to be celebrated on July 30th every year. The purpose is to promote friendships and peaceful relations among people. Part of common traditions to commemorate this day include hanging out with friends, throwing parties, and exchanging gifts. This year's theme is deepening international friendships. The focus is on bridging distance gaps, cultural differences, and language barriers. In addition, going ahead to form new friendships and maintain relationships with old friends across the world, especially leveraging technology. Making friends, like you said, of different races is always a good thing because you get to understand different cultures and you can also have a different experience uh, learning more from all these people. So yeah, it's really, it's really good. Maintaining friends across the world is challenging, but if you make it a priority and also you have to be understanding and also open um, to talk about different things that you're going through as you're going through them. <laughs> I, I believe that it will still work for you. I've been able to make friends like with the people I live with. And we have someone from Romania, we have someone from Bangladesh. And I, yeah, th there is like that similarity in cultures. Like, for example, between me and the Romania, like how strict our parents are, you know, our Nigerian culture is like, you're not allowed to do this, that. So when you can resonate to that culture, it really helps. My friendship goal for National Friendship Day is that I need to call my friends. The day is not only to reflect on ways to promote peace amongst individuals, but among communities and nations. Make sure that you care for your citizenry. Make sure that there is justice and equity, period, and everything will be okay. Remember, it is not what we have, but who we have in our lives that truly matters. Happy International Friendship Day. Gabriel Egu, reporting for New Central TV.